So we're back here at Marriott Cypress Harbor in Orlando, Florida. Perhaps you're considering it for your next trip. Well, do you want to see a two bedroom villa? Let's check out ours right after this. Hello and welcome to Destination Timeshare. I'm Jeremy and before we get started taking a look at our two bedroom villa here at Marriott Cypress Harbor in Orlando, Florida, I just want to let you know on this channel I like to provide my knowledge tips and advice to help you get the most from your timeshare ownership. And hey, if you don't happen to own timeshare, but you like staying at these beautiful resorts, I also do resort tours, resort reviews, and villa tours. So be sure to subscribe down below, and also hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on a single video. So let's get going. We're going to head into our two bedroom villa here at Cypress Harbor and show you around. Heading inside the two bedroom villa here at Marriott Cypress Harbor, you have a pretty nice large entryway. And just off that is a large utility room. And get this, inside there you're gonna find a full size washer and dryer. This villa was actually just recently renovated and you can tell that nobody's really even been in here because I'm not noticing any lint in that lint trap. In this utility room, you're also going to find the iron, ironing board, as well as a vacuum cleaner. Back out here into the entryway, you have in here a pretty nice large mirror, as well as some nice artwork on the walls. Now let's head into the guest bedroom. This is kind of the one disappointing thing that we really don't like about these villas at Marriott Cypress Harbor. This guest bedroom is pretty small and actually only has a queen size bed in here. There is also a small pull out love seat that we'll take a look at here in a minute. But you do have that queen size bed flanked by a nightstand on each side. In here you also have a dresser to put away any clothes or belongings that you bring with you. And way up there near the ceiling is where you're going to find the television. Like I said, this is kind of the disappointing thing about this room, this guest bedroom at Cypress Harbor. It's pretty small, doesn't have a lot of room in here. But there is that love seat that does pull out into a small sleeping area. And right beside that love seat is also where you're going to find the closet and up there is also some extra bedding to use on that pull-out love seat. One plus, this guest bedroom does have a ceiling fan. Now let's head into the guest bathroom. It's actually not too bad of a size for a guest bathroom. A little bit strange and awkward in here, but you do have the toilet and a single vanity with a large mirror as well. There's also a bathtub with a shower. As we head out into the main living area here, the first thing you're going to notice is the large kitchen. Granite countertops, large cabinets with lots of storage, and a full set of large and small appliances. Okay, so as we finish up taking a look at the kitchen here, I do want to ask if you're liking this video from Destination Timeshare, please do give it a thumbs up. It definitely is appreciated and really helps out this channel and helps out these videos. It tells YouTube that these are great videos and to push them out to more people so more people get to see them when they're planning their trips to this beautiful resort. And also, another great way to help out, share this video. Share it with your friends. Share it with your family. Maybe you're coming to Cypress Harbor with some traveling companions as well. Feel free to share it with them. Don't keep it all to yourself. I also kind of thought this glass subway tile style backsplash was pretty cool. The 
great thing about these cabinets is they come fully stocked. Full set of silverware, dinnerware, glassware, and tableware. As well as storage containers, water pitcher, colander, just about anything you need, you're going to find it in here, as well as a full set of pots and pans. Now something else really nice here is there's also three bar stools that set up against the bar here overlooking the kitchen. So maybe you can have some breakfast there and just sit there while somebody else is doing the work in the kitchen. Now let's move into the dining room area. You do have a large dining room table that will seat six people. You're only going to notice five chairs around that. That's because they have another one with the desk on the other side. So when you need to seat six people at the dining room table, just pull that chair over from the desk. Now into the living room where you're going to find a large sofa that pulls out into a sofa bed. There's also a love seat and a chair, as well as a number of ottomans, and they're kind of cool. You can take the top off, flip it over, and as you can see, it kind of also doubles as a small table. There's also a large flat screen television on the wall there. And inside that TV stand is where you're going to find a Blu-ray player. They also have this 4K HDMI switch. So if you bring maybe a Fire Stick, a Google Chrome, Roku, or some other type of device, feel free. You can just plug it in right there. Then you can stream directly to the television. Okay, now let's head on into the master bedroom. You have a large king-size bed a couple of nightstands, as well as this pretty comfy chair over here in the corner. There's also a nice large flat screen television in the master bedroom here as well, with a very large dresser down below. This is also where you're going to find where they put the pool towels for you to use during your stay in the wonderful pools here at Cypress Harbor. Now let's head into the bathroom area and this is where you're going to find the world famous jetted bathtub that they have here at Marriott Cypress Harbor. It literally takes up almost half of the bathroom area. It is huge, yet to date we have still never used it. I'm thinking in the future I'm going to need to do a video about that jetted tub. Across from the jetted tub, you also have a pretty good large size closet there, hangers, the in-room safe, as well as some extra bedding. Moving further into the master bathroom here, you do have a really nice large double vanity with a large mirror. Separated from the rest of the bathroom here, behind this door is where you'll find the toilet as well as the entry into what is actually a pretty small shower. All right, now it's time to head outside and take a look at the patio out here. A pretty large patio table with four fairly new nice chairs. There's also a plug-in out here and an overhead ceiling fan. Now our patio did have a pretty nice view out to the lake on what was a beautiful day. Okay so there you have it the two-bedroom villa here at Marriott's Cypress Harbor in Orlando, Florida. Are you planning a trip here in the near future? Let me know down in the comments below and if you have any questions about this resort also, feel free to ask those too. But if you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And to see more videos about Timeshare, check out the description box below. 
And for another video about Marriott Cypress Harbor, check out this one right up here and YouTube. They think you'll like that one down there. Be sure to subscribe. You can do so by clicking on my picture right here. Hit that notification bell. And until next time, remember, the best destination is always a timeshare.